Once upon a time, in the heart of a lush green jungle lived a curious little monkey named Momo. Momo was no ordinary monkey. He was a bundle of joy and energy, always ready for a new adventure. Every morning as the sun painted the sky with bright colors, Momo would wake up and start his day with a big stretch and a wide yawn. Then with a gleam in his eyes and a spring in his step, he would scamper up the tallest tree, his tiny fingers grasping the branches as he swayed with the breeze. Up in the trees, Momo felt like the king of the jungle and he loved to swing from branch to branch, his laughter ringing through the air. But Momo's favorite part of the day was breakfast time. And do you know what he loved the most? Yes, you guessed it right, bananas. Momo was a banana enthusiast. He loved the sweet taste of ripe bananas and he could never resist a juicy banana hanging from a tree. With a swift movement, he would pluck the banana, peel it with his nimble fingers and gobble it up in no time. Momo was not only a playful monkey, but also a sociable one. He loved meeting his friends in the jungle. There was Lulu, the chatty parrot, who always had a story to share. Then there was Buzzy, the busy bee who never stopped buzzing around. And let's not forget Toto, the tortoise, who was slow but very wise. Momo loved playing with them, sharing his bananas and listening to their stories. Each day was a new adventure for Momo. He loved exploring the jungle, playing with his friends, and of course, eating lots of bananas. His life was full of fun, laughter, and exciting discoveries. And above all, Momo loved his home in the jungle. But what he loved even more were his friends. They made his life in the jungle even more special. And so, Momo the little monkey loved his home in the jungle and he loved his friends even more. Every morning Momo woke up to the beautiful symphony of sounds from his friends. The jungle was a concert where every creature played its part. Picture the mighty lion, his deep and powerful roar echoing through the trees. It's a grand and regal sound, isn't it? Next, let's listen to the elephant. Her trumpet is loud and clear, announcing to the world that she's here. It's a sound that commands respect, don't you think? Now imagine the core of the crow. It's a sharp and raucous sound that cuts through the morning air. The crow is like the jungle's alarm clock, reminding everyone it's time to start the day. Lastly, think of the snake, hissing softly in the grass. It's a quiet, delicate sound, almost like a whisper. It reminds us that even the smallest voices are part of the symphony. Momo loved the symphony of sounds. It was music to his ears. Momo was just one of the many animals in the vast animal kingdom. This kingdom is so big and so wide it's filled with all sorts of creatures each one unique and special in its own way. Let's imagine a world full of birds. Birds like the tiny hummingbird that flits from flower to flower, or the mighty eagle soaring high in the sky. There are mammals too, like cuddly koalas that love to munch on eucalyptus leaves, or playful dolphins that leap and dive in the ocean waves. Then there are reptiles, like the slow-moving tortoise who carries its home on its back, or the slippery snake slithering through the grass. And let's not forget the insects, like busy bees buzzing around, and beautiful butterflies fluttering their colorful wings. Animals can live on land, in water, or sometimes both. They can climb trees, dig burrows, or even fly in the sky. All these different animals make our world a wonderful place, just like Momo's jungle. From Momo's adventures, we've learned a lot about different animals. Monkeys, like Momo, love to swing from tree to tree in the lush green jungle, this is their home, their habitat. They love to chatter and play, just like you and me. We've also learned that each animal has its own unique voice, from the mighty roar of the lion to the gentle coo of the dove. This symphony of sounds is their way of communicating, their language. We've seen the incredible diversity in the animal kingdom, from the tiniest insect to the largest whale, each with its own unique role in the circle of life. This shows us just how important each and every animal is, they all deserve our love, care, and respect. Just like Momo, every animal has a story. Let's promise to love and respect all animals because they make our world so much more exciting and beautiful.